I posted some stuff for sale on the Facebook group for Prelude stuff, and a guy reached out and said, hey, I'm interested in your item. Hey, welcome back to Loot Quest, everybody. So today, something came in the mail not even 30 minutes ago. I'm pretty psyched about it. I'm gonna be honest with you up front. It's probably not gonna excite nobody but me. But uh, something came across uh, Facebook Messenger. Somebody reached out to me and said, I got something you might be interested in. And they were right. So let's get down to it. Let me crack these things open and uh, see what we got. So what excites me is boring. Empty boxes. Why do I get excited about an empty box? Or for one, because it's prelude related. And two, and I'm not exaggerating when I say this, this might be the only set of original boxes left in the world. Epic. For the 95 optional dealer accessory silver wheels on the wall. So, how did I find these boxes? Well, the boxes kind of found me. So, I posted an item for sale. I had a bra, an original front nose mask for the Prelude that I had that I've been hoarding. I posted it up for sale. A guy messages me and said, Hey, I'm interested in the bra that you have, but I may have something you're interested in. So, I said, Let's hear it. And he says, I have boxes for original SE wheels. So I said, keep talking, because I'm a huge uh, fan of the special edition, of course, and especially the dealer accessory wheels, the red and the silver. And then he sends me pictures of these. And not only are they special edition wheel boxes, these are more than special edition wheel boxes, right? This is the dealer option silver wheels that basically don't exist. Try to find a set online, try to find a picture of a set that's not a factory brochure, you won't find a picture. So not only did he have boxes of Honda genuine accessory wheels, but it was the silver version, which is even more rare than the red version. I've seen boxes for the red version just once, but I've seen it. Silver, I've never seen before. So let me show you on Honda's website, and I'll, I'll put a picture up now, of the part number for the red wheels and the silver wheels, and then you can see the boxes for specifically for the silver dealer accessory wheel. So I'll put that up so now. You can see this picture taken from a 1993 factory brochure. You can see the bra on the left and you can see the red and the silver factory dealer option wheels uh, with the Prelude center caps that we're talking about. And we're talking about the boxes for the silver wheels. And as you can see in this next photo here, this is from Honda's website, one of the parts websites. You can see the uh, part numbers for the silver and the red, the silver being 170F and this uh, 170G. And of course, they've been discontinued for many years now. The 170F is the right-hand side of the silver. 170F right-hand, 170G left-hand, 170G left-hand. So the guy I got them from, said that he picked them up from a guy on Craigslist and he was shopping for Prelude wheels and he found saw blades, right? The 94 to 96 OE wheels. And he bought them, but they came in these boxes. So the story was the guy he bought the wheels from, the saw blades, in 95 bought a BB1 that he took it home. After 300 miles, he went to Honda and ordered the silver accessory wheels here and put them on his 95 VTEC and took his stock saw blades and stuck them in these boxes and sold the saw blades in these boxes to the guy that I bought them from. So, so these are the original boxes for the silver wheels, right? So I've never, like I said, I've never seen another set of the silver wheels, much less the boxes. And like I said, I bought these out of Maryland. They were trashed. They looked terrible. I'll post up a picture of the before and the after of me getting these wheels done. I 
had them done at a, a wheel shop about an hour away. They came out really nice. I think it was about 762 bucks was the total overall, which is a pretty good deal to get them refinished. But um, when the boxes, when the guy sent me the picture of the boxes, I had to have them, right? So we worked out a deal where I traded them the bra for the four empty boxes. It didn't matter what it cost to get them. I had to have them because I've got the wheels to go with the boxes. It's just, it adds more to the collectability to me. I think it's really cool to have. But uh, I'm pretty excited about it. Probably doesn't excite nobody else, but empty boxes. The fact that I have the wheels to go with them, to me it increases the value and increases the collectability of it. So I'm pretty excited to have them. So I appreciate y'all watching. That's all I got for you today. I hope I didn't bore y'all too bad with empty boxes. But uh, I'm pretty excited about it just, you know, because I'm crazy about Prelude crap. So either way, I appreciate y'all watching. And uh, y'all look out for the next video. Don't know when it's going to be. I'll try to come up with some ideas. The kid's been bugging me to make more content. So appreciate y'all watching. Y'all take it easy.